Welcome to my channel, hope you're doing well. So Taurus, this video will be for you if you have any Taurus placements, if you're dealing with a Taurus. All right, guys, so, um, okay, so doing, I'm going to see what comes out today, okay? I kind of feel the need to see what is being addressed. So I'm just sneaking in a little reading for you guys. I am do look, Taurus, and those who are waiting on the other placements um, for their readings, I'm doing them okay i've done cancer and leo okay and i'll be doing gemini as well and i will do uh virgo libra scorpio and the rest of them okay in order but i'm just doing an extra reading for you okay all right guys so for those that don't know welcome to my channel hello um i'm doing a competition so tarot tarot decks oracle cards i don't even know how many i've got i think I've got about 16, 17 to give away, okay, guys? So one of those could be yours. All you've got to do is press like, subscribe, okay? Because, guys, nearly at 30,000 subscribers, okay? So let's try and make this happen, okay, guys? It's exciting. So I'm um, nearly at 30,000 subscribers. So thank you to everybody who supports the channel. I appreciate you who supports me. I love you all, all right? I won't go into it too much, but thank you. All right, so, yeah, all you got to do is just comment where you're watching from, okay? Actually, wanted to say as well, who's your favourite person? Like, is it your... Uh, so, I know someone's going to say themselves, but, like, is it your... Is it, is it one of... Is it, like, say, some of you guys have got a child. Is it your child? Is it your mum? Is it your dad? Is it your, is it your sister? Your best friend? Who's your favourite person? You can also, also comment that as well. I thought that'd be nice. <clears throat> Anyways... Um, some of you guys will say God, of course, um, but like, let's just say living wise, okay, living wise, yeah? All right, anyways, um, someone who's actually, do you know what I mean? Look, I'm getting into it. Anyways, guys, um, <laughs> all right, let's do it. Angel number, I will do this, and I'm going to use a deck that I've been using in the last few readings for you. The Soul, the soul Truth Awareness deck, it's this one, okay? All right, because some, some of you guys asked me about that. Um, it's called the Soul Truth Self-Awareness Card Deck. That's what it's actually called, okay? So, for anyone that wants to know, Taurus, tell me about Taurus, please. Oh, it's... Mm -mm. Three come out, I'll take them. I'll take them. I was going to get one, but, okay. We have 44, I am supported... Your angels are encouraging you to continue on your present life path with diligence and determination and even greater success will come in in the future. Yes, thank you. 777, okay. So if you guys, that could be a lucky number or even four, it could be a lucky number as well. We have here, I am in the flow. Your purpose flows from within you and everything that is unfolding or being revealed to you is part of your purpose. A state of peace and calmness in your soul, okay? And the last one is number 14, I am practical. That's definitely your earth sign trait, okay? You are open-minded and always up to try something new, yet you are wise enough to stop and think before you jump into things. This pragmatic approach helps ensure your time, attention and efforts are meaningful. I heavily resonate with that. Um, all right, guys. Guys, if you've been watching me for a while and you ain't subscribed, please subscribe. I would love to. I would love to get to thirty thousand by the end of this week. That would be amazing. I know that's definitely easily achievable. But guys, oh my god, yeah. All right, let's do it. Tell me, tell me about Taurus, please. Tell me about Taurus. What does this say? Okay. I haven't got this one before. This is a, well, this is a fairly new deck, but I've used it a few times now throughout the last week. Anyways, where can I create more space? I haven't read this one, so let's see what it says. Instead of filling yourself up with busy work and create and and things to do, create more sacred space in your schedule. I said that. I said that today. Sacred space. Um in in cancer's reading and it wasn't me reading cards it was literally what i got so some of you guys 
you have cancer in your chart if you do watch the cancer reading as well okay there's messages in there for you trust me okay um let me do that again instead of filling yourself up with busy work and things to do create more sacred space in your schedule in your home your mind your lungs and in your heart take time to just be very important that's how we keep grounded that is how we keep grounded if we're constantly living in the past or constantly living in the future that causes either that can be that can really cause depression and or anxiety or the combination of both okay so being in the moment being in the present giving thanks appreciating so appreciate um, showing your appreciation it does listen you you know a lot of you guys you you know you understand this already okay but if anyone's feeling like why am i overly focused on this just be in the moment be present be present okay it will help you so much all right okay so today's soul action is do a clutter detox of your schedule home and innermost self make space clarity will come and funny enough that is resonating with me i'm a taurus moon okay so i totally get that uh, 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 yeah all right let's use this deck tell me about taurus please what does taurus need to know oh it's going to be one of those reads okay what you need to know and what you want to know that's what i'll do okay so what does taurus need to know please for whenever they watch this reading six page of wands now a cup some of you guys may find yourself having some very flirtatious conversations with somebody okay dates coming up you're being invited you might see somebody that's like okay you look good i will let me, let me get to know you if you're already with somebody this could be you guys kind of you know keeping things going okay in regards to the chemistry all that stuff um in your connection could be a fire sign or a water sign that you're connecting with okay aries leo sagittarius pisces cancer scorpio tell me more could be somebody that's a bit younger as well we have judgment okay some of you guys it could be a lot younger or a lot older um so okay why the judgment tell me seven of swords temptation it's giving me temp it's making me feel like there's something that you're tempted by or someone is tempted by you taurus what what is this tell me the queen of swords yeah the ten of wands <clears throat> you know when someone says don't go in that room or don't go down there yeah and you're like but why what's in that room or what's down there and some of you guys are about to find out oh you already know okay it's almost like someone knowing that they for whatever reason and i will get down to the reason in a moment okay that probably oh taurus temptation this is temptation okay this is about knowing that something either isn't right for you cross watcher could be how you're feeling as well um knowing that uh, maybe this is what well, i'm uh, i'm intrigued I'm, i want this okay so i'm gonna throw throw a few things what this could be throw a few things out there what this could be is either it could be an ex who had amazing sex and that's the only person that you're wanting or needing right now even though you know it ain't gonna go anywhere or you might get in your feelings they might get in their feelings it might start up something again something toxic something that's not gonna go anywhere you may feel stuck on them for a while you may not open up to new people all that all that palaver right some of you guys it could be a new person where you're like this person's got a lot on their plate queen of swords ten of wands yeah this person's got a lot on their plates okay they have no time for me or i have no time for them i don't see this working how are we gonna how are we gonna um mold into each other's life how are we gonna do this whoa like and it's almost seeing like that something ain't really gonna like come to fruition 
so, something ain't gonna work out right something and it's like but I'm I want to see what's going on or I want to just have a little last you know bit of fun all right so so right it's like you already know I don't feel like I'm telling you something that you don't already know or feel or thought about right Let's see how this person's feeling towards you. I want to see if the energy, if it's a mutual feeling. Yeah. Or I want to see if this person's on a different page. Let's see. Tell me, tell me about how this person feels towards Taurus. The star. They put you in a pedestal. You're something that they've been wanting. You're a wish. You're a fantasy. Oh, because some of you guys, this person's kind of bigged you up, hyped you up. Okay. They could be like... A, you know, a hype man, a cheat, like a cheap personal cheerleader or something like that. This person makes you feel good. I'm surprised the six of one. Well, I only pulled one card, but I wouldn't be surprised if the six of ones come out. Yeah, all this stuff, queen of ones. Someone's making you feel good. Someone's like Taurus. Yeah, I see. I see you. I see you going to the gym, or I see you. You know, it's uh, everyone like what, whether you want to lose weight, put on weight, whatever it is. Okay, or I see you in your hair style, or I okay with a nice car or someone's like someone's making you feel good and you're liking that but at the same time it's like I kind of feel deep down this is I'm speaking like of you now I feel deep down that this may not go anywhere but I ain't doing nothing else or so let me let me let me just see all right let's look Taurus let's see tell me more how does this person see feel think about Taurus the four of pentacles, they're something that they, they don't want to let this slide, let this go. I was, about, look, I was about to make a little joke here, but let me not today. Yeah, let me let me cut down on that a little bit. Anyways, yeah, um, this person is like, I might not meet someone like Taurus again. And I feel like you're feeling that energy, Taurus. Crosswatcher, this could be how a Taurus feels about you as well. It could be a mutual... I, this is... This is... Look, I've picked up on you being repulsed by people in the last few weeks. Um, people giving you the ick. Is, that's not the same person, is it? That can't be the same person. So, I mean, this could be somebody new. So, or somebody that you already know but haven't really, you know hasn't been like that before in the past maybe you guys are trying something or whatever it is okay this person's like i like taurus and they're making it known i don't feel like this person's hush hush about their feelings with you okay but I i'm feeling this sense of excitement okay i just th well i just i just saw something i just saw I don't know what it's called, yeah, but you know when they have like, it, they do this with men as well, but it's um, with a, a naked woman. Oh, this sounds deep now. This is extra, but this is how this person, I think this is how this person is seeing you. Like you're a treat, you're a snack, you're a full meal, whatever you want to call it, right? Listen, I definitely ate a snack, I'm a full meal, yeah? Listen, anyways, I saw a woman on a table with lots of fruit over her body parts. Beautiful, yeah? Someone's just like, ooh, I can just eat off you. I, mm, like, someone's gassing you up. Some of you guys may not know what I'm on about, but let's just say someone is making you feel very good, okay, about yourself. And especially if you're coming from a place, Taurus, where you're, you, some of you guys may feel great about yourself, whether it's um, what you do in, in your life, work, your family. Some of you guys, it could be like body wise, like maybe you're not feeling where you need to be in, in regard to your physique, your health and stuff like that. How you would like, how you're comfortable looking, feeling and stuff like that. Someone's like, oh no, Taurus, I like you. So if you guys are predicting some, some, somebody, Tell me more. The King of Cups. Ooh. Someone might fall in love with you. Or someone is moving like that. Hey, tell me more. The Five of Cups. Some of you guys don't want to disappoint this person. Someone knows that this ain't going to go anywhere. Has this conversation be, been had 
probably for some of you, definitely not for for the rest of you. Um, oh, five of five of cups, seven of swords. Some of you guys feel like you. I okay. <sighs> Someone needs to make it clear what this is, okay? You need to make it clear. They need to make it clear. Like, this conversation needs to be had, okay? Um, should we just have fun? Let's not get too serious. Or or um, maybe I'm not ready for something right now, but I'm open to X, Y, Z. Or maybe I don't want to hurt you. Let's leave it alone. If you feel like you're going to catch feelings, then I don't want to go put you through that. I don't want to... Neither of us will feel good. So that conversation is needs to be had, right? This is this is. Mm. Some of you guys, it could be an ex. Some of you guys is a brand new person. Like only you will know. You you know, the chariot, the emperor. Yeah, basically what what I'm just saying. Take charge of the situation. I say, but anyways, I do feel like somebody. Someone's coming up with this um, big D energy. If you don't know what that is, some if, some if guys, if you go through the comments and you see somebody saying, what is that? Let them know what it is. Yeah, cause I don't want to say it on my channel just in case. Listen, big D energy, yeah? Oh my God. Even right, even if it's a female, it's a female that's very confident, that's very um in tune with a lot of things. Okay, she knows what uh, what she wants. What, what, I, regardless of this gender, yeah, regardless. This feels like his built up tension, Taurus. It feels built up. It feels like it's almost. It's almost like I need to see Wagwan. I need to see like what they're working. So, so I don't know what kind of conversations you guys be, are having yet, but I, listen, I'm picking up on. Yeah, I'm picking up on um, this needs to be experienced. Someone's feeling like that. All right, let's let's keep it moving. Tell me more. The Tower. Yep. The Four of Swords. The five of wands. All right. Why? Tell me why. The four of cups. Yeah, it's, it's basically what I said, guys. Yeah. So. Especially if there's another person in the mix. Now, I don't know what your uh, status, status is, guys. Whatever you status. I say status like relationship wise yeah some of you could some of you guys it could be a thing where you are married but separated and you are interested in somebody somebody's interested in you some of you guys you could have just broken up with somebody very recently and you've met somebody like yo i did not expect to meet somebody this quick i kind of feel guilty about it what if i get back with my uh, past person my ex what if and what if i ruin the chances of this but i this person intrigues me i don't know which way how that's working out in your life yeah i'm not like couples tauruses couples if you're in a couple i don't feel like this is your reading today if it is it could be it could, it could be for some of you guys but it feels more so of a um single situationship you know, recently single, that kind of, it feels like that group more so, but if you're in a couple and things have happened, gone down, or if you're in a poly relationship, whatever, I don't know how to say it, if you're in a poly relationship, yeah, you know what I'm trying to say, it could be that as well, so I'm trying to be as open as possible to see where it can make sense in 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 your love life, but if we don't resonate, leave it alone and watch your other placements, don't, don't make it fit now. Don't be like um, Cinderella's ugly sisters on forcing that size five, six shoe to fit when they don't fit. Leave it alone for someone else that it fits perfectly for. Oh, that was a l anyways, let's keep it moving. That, that's funny though. But yeah, I do feel like, I do feel like, um, it feels like a one, 
it don't feel I don't like how would how will how would how will this go? How will this end up? Three, give me three. The six the six of swords, the nine of cups, and the ace of wands. Big D energy, yeah. I know there's someone watching me saying, what's she talking about? <laughs> Big D, yeah, if you don't get it. Anyways, um, some of you guys are going to do this regardless. Six of Swords, Nine of Cups. Some of you guys have got, um, you've got, what's it called? You've got something to fulfill. You've got needs. You have needs, yeah? You have needs, okay? And this is like the Nine of Cups, that, that person, they're content within themselves. They, they're, they're happy. Like, it's not necessarily to please the other person. It's more so themselves. And then Ace of Wands is there. I'm sorry. It is, that's literally what it's showing me, okay? With this energy in this reading, okay? I know some people, some people are extra as hell telling me how to read my cards. You read your cards the way you want to read them, okay? I get the story. Some people literally just read the cards. I don't just do that, okay? So read your cards your way for it. Let, very rarely I get that, but some people think, oh, this is, no, it's not that deep. Like, it's not that deep. Anyways, I do see someone doing it regardless. I think I'm going to leave it there. It's a cheeky little reading for you guys today, and it definitely was that cheeky. Um, literally, no pun intended, it is what it is. Um, it looks fun, it looks exciting. Um... I f this is a very like regardless of your age it feels like just you know, you know that feeling when you meet someone that you fancy or meets that excitement it feels like that okay um anyways i'm gonna leave it there remember to comment you can comment where where you're watching from you can, you can comment your favorite person my favorite person is okay um just to give it context because you know sometimes when i watch this back here or people commenting i'm like I don't know what you're talking about. There's no context at all. Like, like, you might say, no, I don't. I don't know what you're talking about. Anyways, uh, I'm being extra now. Uh, I love you guys. I'm going to leave you. Press the like button on the way out, on the way out if you haven't done already. Subscribe if you haven't done. Let's get to 30,000 by the end of the week. We can do this. All right, guys. I'll see you in your next reading. Bye, guys.